What's good, YouTube? It's your boy D Money here, back with another banger video, man. And today, as you guys can see by the title, man, they set you up, but it was the worst decision ever chosen. One. Before we start this video, guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. A lot of you guys are watching the vids, but aren't subscribed? Go ahead, hit that subscribe button. It'll help support the channel. Also, guys, we are doing a giveaway at 15k subscribers, guys. All you guys got to do is hit that subscribe button, hit that post bill notification, and you win there like swimmer. You dig? Comment down below what you guys want to see next, and I got y'all, man. Y'all been showing me so much love, and I really do appreciate that. Now, before we start this video, guys, like I always state, take everything that I say with a grain of salt. My perspective might change a day, two days, a year from now. Who knows? We're constantly growing, and if you're not growing, what are you doing? Also, guys, I love hearing the stories, the messages. You guys are such a big inspiration. When I read the comments, I literally see the positivity, the growth. I literally have the best community on YouTube. And if you guys have something more personal to tell me, let me know on Instagram. I do respond. I might be a couple days late, but I do respond. And if you guys do not agree, you know what I'm saying? If you if you guys have something more personal, like I said, check me out on Instagram. I do respond. You know what I'm saying? And if you guys do not agree with what I'm saying, please let me know in the comment section down below. I'm under, I'm understanding. I'm understanding. I got an open mind. This is an open-minded channel. My bad, y'all. So listen, y'all. Y'all know how I talk to y'all all the time, man. If you're a chosen one. Not even if you're a chosen one. If you stay prayed up, if you take care of your mental, your mind, your body, your soul, if you are constantly working on yourself, if you do right by others and don't expect anything in return, they set you up and it was the worst decision they ever made. You feel me? You don't necessarily have to be a chosen one. You don't necessarily have to be, you know what I'm saying, super you know, spiritual. You feel what I'm saying? You don't necessarily have to be that. But a lot of people made a mistake by trying to set you up, bro. So a lot of y'all were good people. A lot of y'all are good people to this world. You, you know what I'm saying? You, you, you are good friends to these people. You are good partners to these people. You know what I'm saying? And they set you up. They did you dirty. They 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 made the worst decision decision ever. And I'm not gonna say it was their worst decision ever, but it was probably one of the top few. And they still think about it to this day. They still think about how they messed up with this person. How they how they messed up with you or some of you guys are thinking the same thing. How you messed up with somebody else? You you set them up. You know what I'm saying? And it don't necessarily have to be set up to where you endanger their life. It's just set up to where you mess up their life. You know what I'm saying? You may not have to kill the person in GTA. Let's just say that. But you could just you could just mess up their life. You could just have them have a setback for them. You could do all type of stuff that'll just cause their life to take five more years to get to where they need to be. You feel me? And some people did the same thing to y'all, bro. Some people set y'all up. And it don't mean it don't necessarily have to be physical all the time. It could be mentally or spiritually. You feel me? They set you up. They put you in the wrong position. They put you in the wrong mindset. And now you set back a couple days. You set back a couple years. You set back, you know what I'm saying, 10 years from what you were trying to do, where you were trying to be. And it be like that sometimes, man. Listen, bro. Be honest with y'all. Because you so prayed up, because you got that energy, because you got that divine energy, bro. Because your vibrations are so high, I tell you guys all the time, energy is everything, right? Energy. We we you, if you think about it, prayer is energy. You know what I'm saying? You you you. It's like a it's like a light meditation. You know what I'm saying? But you talking to God. You know what I'm saying? So not only are you praying, but you're manifesting what you want. You have the positive energy. You already have the the energy that you need to reflect off all those negative vibes you know what i'm saying because when you when you take care of yourself when you meditate when you stay prayed up when you uh you know what i'm saying got high vibrations your vibrations not low you got this shield around you got this aura around you that protect you away from people that like that, that try to hurt you you know what i'm saying some of y'all literally have physically been set up some of y'all have physically been set up to the point you know what i'm saying where it, it almost cost you your life but you had this one feeling, bro. Like some of y'all had these feelings. I know personally, me. Like I, I, I've, I've had some feelings. Like, bro, don't, don't go to this place. Don't go to this. Don't go to this spot. Hey, this girl trying to get you to come over right now, bro. I personally, I come over 10, 15 minutes early just to see if somebody else is leaving the house. Just to see if you're trying to set me up. Just to see if you're trying to get me. And I, the thing is, guys, I always think like this because of where I came from, and 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 my family, and and how we, how we, how we roll. Cause nigga. My family crazy, bro. And I'm going to just keep it at that. But you see how people are in this world. You see how things go down. And you like you 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 and if you don't expect that 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 to happen to you, you crazy. 
If you don't expect people to try to do the same thing to you, you're crazy. You got to remember, some people just set you up because your character, just because of who you are, because of how people treat you, because of how people love you. And they get jealous, so they try to take you out. You know what I'm saying? You get jealous that people get, people get, people try to take you out. People try to set you up because of what you have. And you may not even have much, but they still jealous of what you have. People try to take you out because of where you're going. Shit, people try to take you out because you, they know that you, that you are a good person. Shit, these men and these women that set you up, get you pregnant, do all type of stuff just to have you in their fingers for the rest of their life. You feel me? Literally will set you up to prevent you from getting into getting in the position that you need to be in so that way you can thrive and be successful in life. You feel me? And this is how it go, bro. And just because somebody can't have you, they'll set you up. That's important, bro. You got to realize that some some people out here are crazy, bro. Some people try to set you up. just be, But the thing is, it never works. It never works with you guys. It never works. And maybe you might go through it. You might have the experiences where you feeling like crap. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, fuck, bro. I'm really going through this right now. But the thing is, God still saved you. You know what I'm saying? I always used to pray. And I always used to, you know what I'm saying, ask the universe. I say, man, move the mountains or move me. Not only did it move the mountains, but it also moved me. He moved me, you know what I'm saying? And and a, and a lot of places that I've been in, a lot of people that I've met, I was able to successfully get away from those people. I was able to successfully get away from, you know what I'm saying? People that were being used to get at me or people that were trying to have me come over to the house so that, they, you know what I'm saying, they could, so they can get me. Or people, you know what I'm saying? It just don't matter, bro. Even family would, even family would do it, do you dirty, bro. And you'd be like, whoa, like I thought we, you know, first of all, we blood. But like I tell you guys all the time, blood ain't thicker than water. I mean, I mean, say just because I'm not gonna say that. Just because blood is thicker than water don't mean that they ain't gonna do you dirty, bro. It's not. They, 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 they bro. You feel me? Like people will still, people will still do you wrong just because you, you, just because you not like them, just because you not like the rest of the family. Just because your cousin, you know what I'm saying? Y'all see it all the time. Cousins kill each other all the time. You be like, damn, like you would think that y'all would be the closest because y'all are cousins. Y'all 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 grow up, y'all the same age, y'all do everything together, y'all chilling together. But people will literally set you up. People will do you dirty, bro. Just because they don't like who you are, just because they don't like your character, your integrity, just because they don't like what you have, and you may not even have nothing. You have the thing is sometimes you can have less than another person, but they still want what you have. Because they're not satisfied. They're not content with what they have. Man, isn't, you never be content with what you have, but you never be jealous of what somebody else has. And when you are chosen, when you when you divinely protected, when you stay prayed up, when you always connected with the universe and you tapped in and you got the high vibrations and you got the positive energy and you got the positive vibes, bro, nothing will ever be able to successfully defeat who you are. Nothing will su successfully be able to stop you from doing what you want to do. Nothing in this lifetime will ever be able to successfully bring you out you know what I'm saying? To like tear you down, set you up, do anything negative to you. You know what I'm saying? In this realm that we live in, physical, you know what I'm saying, physical hurt, you know, they can they can mess with your mental, they can mess with your spiritual all day. Those are things that those are the things that are really hard to protect, you know what I'm saying? But that physical form, devil can't do nothing about it, bro. He can only send people to hurt you, but he can't physically himself. You feel me? So you you gotta you gotta for for one you gotta have discernment. And that's the most important thing that you guys gotta have is discernment. Discernment is key, man. Especially living in this world, bro, because you gotta you gotta follow your gut feeling. You gotta follow your intuition, whatever you wanna call it. Gut feeling, intuition. You know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah. Follow that, bro, because it'll tell you your, your 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 gut will tell you, hey, bro, this ain't right. Let's go ahead and get out of here. Hey, bro, leave this person alone, bro. They ain't right, bro. They they yeah they ain't right bro you already saw it from the jump but you steady st come on bro leave him alone bro you know what i'm saying like and, and, and the thing is bro sometimes we don't follow our mind sometimes we don't follow our gut and that's when you start to that's when things start to go wrong you got to always follow those things you always got to be in tune with yourself and that's the whole point of meditating that's the whole point of getting in tune with yourself going outside grounded so that you know when certain things is not right when you get that feeling like bro i gotta go you gotta go because that's nothing but your ancestors talking to you telling you they already seen this you know what i'm saying and if y'all don't believe in multi-dimensional things if y'all don't believe in, in things in that nature 
then hey, it is what it is, bro. I, I I can't really, I can't really help you out, man. All I can do is give you the, I can give you the word, bro. If it's a snake in the backyard, and I go back there and I see the snake, and I come back upstairs and I see that you heading downstairs, and I tell you, hey, don't go back there, and it's a snake back there. I done did my job. You come out there and you get bit by the snake and you say, bro, how come you didn't stop me? How come you didn't physically stop me? I can never physically stop you from doing what you want to do. All I can do is tell you. I can give you the word. If you don't believe it, you don't believe it. And this is what I'm doing to you guys. This is what I'm telling you, man. So this is what your gut is telling you sometimes. The gut the, the gut is like, I can't physically stop you, but I can I can tell you mentally. I can tell you physically. I can, I can, I can low-key give you the feeling like, hey, bro, this ain't right. So if you want to stop, you want to stop. If you don't, you don't want to listen to me, you don't got to listen to me. You feel me? Follow your gut, man. A lot of people try to set you up, bro. And even if you haven't been tried, even if somebody hasn't tried to set you up, and like I said, it don't necessarily have to be uh, for money. It could have been, you know, mentally, they could have mentally trapped you. They could have physically trapped you with a kid or physically trapped you with, you know, uh, um, something that they said to get you in trouble with the law enforcement or whatever, bro. You'd be surprised, bro. And it'd be men and it'd be women at the same time. It don't just be women. Fuck no. It'd be everybody. Everybody would try to do something wrong to you, bro. And I'm not saying that, that, that every person that you come across is going to do you dirty. No. Take everything that I say with a grain of salt, bro. But you have come across that one person. And if you haven't, thank God you have it, bro. You don't want to. You feel me? Take care of your mind, your body, and your soul, man. Go outside. I don't know if y'all just saw that bee come in here. But that's a high vibrational being. That's a high vibrational animal. It's insect. You feel me? And the thing is, I'm going to tell y'all this real quick, bro. But when you are afraid of bees, that's when they sting you. When your vibration drops. Because they, they told us so They told us so early on, be afraid of bees. They're not good. At, they're not good to be around. But when you just let them be, they never sting you. If you just let them, they'll be on you. But when you start to get scared is when you when your vibration drop. So you just got to make sure you keep a high vibration at all times. That's just a fool for thought. That comes from whatever comes in life, bro. Have Always have positive energy. Always have positive vibes. Try to at least. You feel me? So like I said, man, take care of your mind, your body, your soul. Go outside, get some sun, get some nature. Drink y'all's water. Eat y'all's fruits and vegetables. If y'all can't, plant y'all's foods. If y'all can't, so be it. Just make sure y'all eating home-cooked meals. Y'all been smashing that like button. Man, I really do appreciate that, man. Let's try to get 300 likes in this video. We are doing a giveaway at 15K subscribers, guys. All you guys got to do is hit that subscribe button. Hit that post bill notification. And you win that like swimmer, you dig? I got the pranks, I got the vlogs, I got what you need. All you need to do is subscribe to D. I'm out of here, man. Peace.